you know, invest in business, but sort of any business as well. If we look at, um, you know, Main Street has really been struggling while Wall Street has been massively benefiting. So, so why do you think there's been that disconnect? Is that just what happens during these exuberant periods or is it something maybe new? Well, it always happens at highs. You know, I could, I could take you through different highs, but I'll take you a few. In the early 80s, oil and gas was hot as a pistol. And every Canadian and, and U.S. oil stock that even went out and hit a, a, a small oil and gas well would just explode and go up. Everybody was in it. And of course, they lost so much money by the time you got out to 85 or 86. And the same thing happened, you know, 97 to 2000. You had all of these people that I knew uh, that quit working and said, hey, you know, I'm just going to day trade now. I'm making so much money. And this, this is my new business is day trading. And so I'm looking up by 2003 or four, nobody was day trading. They took, you know, they took everybody to the woodshed. And so uh, this will be the same generally. It'll work out the same. I mean, you'll have all these people now and they're doing, you know, zero day, you know, zero day to, to, to exit to, uh, to, to options, ODT options and that kind of thing. And, you know, it's just, a, it's a recent phenomena and those things typically won't last for the long term. They last for a while, by the way. So it, that, that's why people do it.